She's ready to go. I was just gonna go get some cows in now. Love it. Well, it's meant to be cold this morning. It's not cold at all, so it's quite cloudy. There we go. That's the reel wound up. We'll just go around this paddock and check to make sure that the uh, gate at the back of it is uh, all set up. What you doing facing that way, girl? <laughs> well, I was only one way to help that. Come on. Come on. Back it up. Back it up. Let me just check the meal bin. Yeah, no poop in there, that's the main thing. Don't want the cows to eat their own poop. Oh, girls, up we go, come on. You have to push back through the mob, come on. Come on. Up we go, girls. Come on. Morning, Dad. How are we this morning? Oh, a bunch of fluffies. A bunch of fluffies. Here we go. We got some milk leaking here. Oh, we got a slip up. The now. Girls are going flat knackers now. More milk into that. Yep. Got the last of that. That's it going through. About to put a rip cycle through it. Going to do a bob day. Just looked out here. There's a cow over there. She looks like she's in the process of carving. Picked up one thousand five. He picked up five thousand one hundred and eighty-seven liters today. The bad. Let's put a rinse cycle through the vat. Follow the cafeteria. <laughs> you dopey little fellas. Come on. That's the other mob feed, Tessa. Good. Let's head for the gate, and we'll leave Tessa to get the motorbike in the. Cafeteria out. Oh yeah, we got one bobby today. I better go put him in the pen. Yeah, it's just shifted the springers. No carvies out there, but could be one to today sometime. It's our last bobby calf of the season because all we've got left now are the cows, which are carving down for Hereford. Should be able to have some good Herefords coming through too. Enough. Hey Dad, your rock plum is flowering. Oh. Why is it rock plum? Because of fruit, you can't eat it. It's too hard. Secondary gateway where the cow's going. Carvey's looking great. Yeah, a couple of them had those shitty asses. They've cleaned up quite well. And they're actually eating the hay really well. More hay for them tomorrow and more meal and more milk. Trench is working well. Need a drink, Aaron? our five that are going up the front now <laughs> because they are close to the carving probably next couple of weeks and here's the other three that are still a fair way away how you go back in there it's the bully gun shh, shh, shh. Oh, shh, shh, shh. come on shh. come on good boy come on girls go see your friends She's probably the furthest away. Oh, let's go. Ha! An enemy tanker! Suddenly, enemy. 
and girls. There they go, silly buggers off to go see their new friends for a couple of weeks and then we should see some more carvies from them. Fed the cows some hay because um, it's not exactly good hay for the calves. It's quite cool here, and the calves weren't eating it as well. So we got some new hay. The dad went and got some new hay the other day, and they seem to be eating that a lot better than the little calves. Also, from up a granny's runoff. Sweet. Little motorbike pulls this uh, trailer really well. Let it overflow for a few minutes. Let, um, let it empty out properly or else it'll burn the seals. That's what I've been told happens. So don't want that. Last longer. Look at how it's come up. It's come up really well. I'm happy with that. I believe Dad will be happy too. I haven't done the bait stations in a while, so I think I'd better check on those. Just make sure that uh, no rats. We've got enough bait for the rats. Yeah, empty. Time for some more bacon. Cheers. Restocked, reloaded. And I'll put it back in the spot. Stop the rats from coming from this area. They're going over there. Um, yeah. That rope boat station is empty. And I've even taken out the one of the little prongs in the middle. Little buggers. Here's our full one. That'll make them happy. Another rat bait station. And our little coffee has gone. So that means we can put that away. So we shouldn't get any more uh, uh, bobby calves. Quite surprised if we do get some more. Another one refilled. As you see, we put 16 baits in it. So <laughs> it'll uh, definitely affect them. Well, cool. Battery's good. Check for any real birds' nests. No birds nests, so we can start her up. All right. Oh, it's been a while since I started. You go, let's see. Let me put that, that's our fuel. Easy peasy. Might have to leave a little two running for a bit. Gotta go check on that cow down there. Yeah. She didn't need a helping hand at all. Just when her calf come, because when I drove over here, she decided to stand up. When her calf come out, he actually landed with his head behind his back, so he couldn't breathe, so he had to quickly run over and pull his head out. Otherwise, I'd pull his head back around the right way. There he is, happy ass, beautiful, black, here for That's all we like to see. So I sprayed around, I sprayed around there, around the uh, edge of the cow shed, so we don't get any grass here, we'll grass growing closer. And uh, he said, might as well go home, go have some breakfast. So, knock off today, we'll go come back for milking this afternoon. See you at milking. Well, we just have Piago tractors here. He's got a nice tractor there, he's driving. 
big 240 horsepower fent. Beautiful. There he goes. The Piaco tractors are nice enough to um, bring out our two-row maze chopper. Yeah, well, we were, we were going to back her into the shed, but uh, as you can see there, the uh, spout's just a bit too tall. Couldn't even get her in the first bay. All right, we got a cow, we got a calf, four, whoa, oh, that's all right. Better the carver now, and then she's all right. If the calf is all right, then uh, try to uh, carve her after when she can't get up. There we go, carved her. Little Carvey come out breach. That's why Dad knew instantly it was time to get her in and carve her. Awesome. <clears throat> Put little Carvey on the trailer. She can sniff it the whole way through. Picked up the one little Carvey. And we need the back cow. Let's just get the cows in. There's three nice bales of hay on there for the calves. And for our carving cows. Awesome, some you're right, arrow pup. I'll go milk some cows. That's all washed. The cows are here. Alright, start the machines, let's get milking. Good girls going around picking up any loose grass out in the morning. Don't worry about too much of it. That's milking done. Just waiting for the uh, tub to fill up and we'll go down and feed out to the cows. A nice bale of hay because you're in the young grass tonight. Best way to keep those nitrates down is to feed them a bale of hay. Dad's just chopped a thistle there. Yeah, that's one dead little thistle. That looks cool. Well, like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the morning. Thank you. This is our young grass paddock. This will be the second time it's been uh, grazed off. Awesome. The cows are happy. We're good. And we are off to go home.